Hey everybody, what's up? It's Bacon Burger King, and I welcome you back to part 20 of Super Mario Galaxy. In the last part, we discovered that there was a comet over here at Dusty Dune, and it's a speedy comet, so yeah, that's why I started off in the bedroom in this episode. So we're gonna just start off the episode by doing this one. Now, I actually tried to record this yesterday while I had part 19, the intrusion video with my friend accidentally co-commentating with me. And, um, well, episode 20, which is actually uploading now, was rendering. And I have a video rendering now, and a, uh, another video uploading right now, and the capture seems to be working fine, because yesterday, like, I was looking at the capture screen on my computer, and it was lagging like crazy. It was like, I stopped the capture to check it, and it was pretty much unwatchable, but it seems to be doing fine for now. And if not, then, uh, I guess I'll just ha you won't be seeing this, obviously. I would have redone it. Because I want these videos to be as high quality as I could possibly make them. You know. So, yeah, I kind of regret talking about E3 throughout the entirety of yesterday's episode. Because it was kind of obnoxious to listen to in editing, because I already knew all those stuff. All the stuff I was talking about. And I had to cut out at least three minutes of my mom vacuuming, which was kind of funny, actually. And if you saw there, the, uh, six life, like the life up mushroom, gets replaced in this level for some reason. It turns into a, uh, what's it called? It turns into a one-up. Oh yeah, and if you couldn't tell, speedster comments, they give you a set amount of time. And you just gotta complete the level in a set amount of time. It's pretty straightforward. Some of them can be pretty tricky. I don't remember this being one of them. Uh, can I? Yeah, you can sort of hop backwards if you s s just barely miss one. Although you probably won't need to do it very often. Because admittedly, this level is not very hard. So let's grab our shell again. Also, the music in the background is pretty intense. I like it. It's like, dude, you gotta hurry up, man! Even though this one isn't particularly hard. It's pretty intense, to say the least. Alright. So, go through the pull stars. Drop down. Let's not fall in the sand. Uh, even though I, j I just said let's not fall in the sand. Yet I decided to do it anyway, because thug life. Alright, we've got 2 minutes and 17 seconds, and we're on the last part of the level. As I said, this particular speedster comet, not much of a problem. I think I already showed off the uh, Good Egg Galaxy speedster comet, which was really easy. But, you know. This one is not much harder. Alright, anyways... Just continuing, it's pretty much the exact same level, except for a few minor differences with the time limit. It's not very hard, in the slightest. Oh yeah, and all enemies have been removed, if you couldn't have told, except for the, at the very beginning. I, and these tornado guys have been removed too. The ones that are over here, for some reason. It's weird stuff, I know. Come on, Mario, get up there. Oof, almost jumped into the quicksand there. Alright, just gotta focus. Hocus, pocus, focus. And get back there. And then we will be done with Dusty Dune for quite some time. I thought I I thought I found the quicksand there. That would have been really bad. And with that, we get our 60th star. So pretty much, I could fight the boss right now if I really wanted to. Which pretty much means, hey, we're halfway through the entire Let's Play right now. We're halfway through the game at this point in time. 60 stars.
And hey, we discovered the final galaxy in the game. And yes, I would like to save my game. Just checking the capture. Doesn't seem like it's lagging very much. If at all. So that's good. The common observatory has full power. Now it can fly through the cosmos again. It's time. Do you want to go to the location of your special one at the center of the universe and beat the game? Wait. Please speak to me once you're ready. <laughs> See, I'm just going to keep putting it off until I feel like it's time to go fight him off screen. So, with that said and done, hmm, we have a hungry Luma that we could do. I guess I'm gonna go down here and do him. Speak to me. Want to go to the Big Mouth Galaxy? Not really, but sure. Okay then. So, I woke up today and I checked the YouTubes. And, I was surprised to find my channel. Also, stupid nunchuck thing. I did swap out the nunchucks, though. Just in case you were wondering. But, I was surprised to find that my channel... My channel? <laughs> my channel. My channel finally hit 60 subscribers. So, thank you all for watching. It means so much to me. Alright, so... I don't like this level. I mean, I like beach ball for its swimming. I don't like this one. I don't remember liking this one at all. It's annoying. I don't like it. So, pretty much, if memory serves me right, what we're gonna have to do is get a golden shell of some sort. I think that's what it is. We're gonna have to get some sort of shell. And with said shell, I believe that um, we have to go open that chest. How we get there, I don't remember. All I know is that there are star chips, and star chips usually mean something. So I'm just gonna keep looking around for these star chips. Can I go in here? Nope, they just push you away. Yeah, I think we gotta get up there. I just don't know how. It's probably... Probably after I get all the star chips, it'll be like a warp star of some sort to throw me up there. I'm just hoping that... You don't have to get star chips up there. Alright, nah. Because I see two more down here. So that must mean the last one is somewhere down here as well. But yeah, once again, thank you guys for... It's actually 61 subscribers. Which is ironic, because that's how many stars we're, at the very least, going to get in this video. So, yeah. Each of these stars represents one view. Yeah. Yeah, I can't believe I'm halfway through this game, though. I mean, I'm only on episode 20. And I'm halfway through it, which is surprisingly good. And uh, with that, we've got our mini warp star, which are going to take up to the next level of water and stuff. Alright. Yeah, I was right. The thing I like, though, about the uh, Hungry Luma Galaxies is most of them are relatively short. Which is a good thing. Except for the cases of, um... What's it called? I'm trying to remember the name of it. Because it's my favorite one. It's the first one. It's like the Rocky Road Galaxy. It's the sweet one. I love that one. It's got the cool Mario 3 music. It's Yeah, it's got the Mario 3 music. And I just like the level design of it. It's fun. It's easy and fun. What more could you ask for? Well, maybe hard and fun, but still. Yeah! And with that, we retrieve... Toad. Man, that was close! Oh, Mario! I forgot to tell you something. 
I was trying to get a star, but I fell into this treasure chest. Let me tell you, it's even smaller than it looks. Anyway, here's the power star I found. No, really, it's yours. Yay! 61 stars to represent all of my current number of subscribers. Yeah! Guys, we're just 8 stars away, and then 8 subscribers away from the greatest number in existence. Get me there. Please, I don't care if that's the number I get stuck on forever. I just need to get there eventually. Do -do 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 -do. That wasn't that bad. I remember it being a lot worse, to be honest. Alright, let's see, is there anything else we can do? Would you like to see the map? Here you go. So, no comets. That's a shame. Let's talk to this guy, maybe he can, uh, spawn some comets for us. Hey, ho, if you need... Hey, ho, let's go. If you need to know... Of anything about pranks or comets, I'm your Luma. How can I help you? Move it! Wanna move that prankster comet? Well, have I got the deal for you right now for only 20 pa uh, four easy payments of 5 star bits. I'll fling it somewhere else. Shipping and handling, not included. Let me have it. Delicious. Now that I'm all happy and full, I'm feeling a little bit more motivated. Ahem. <laughs> also, the greatest catchphrase of all time. Snacky D. Snack a day. Snack a dilly do. Hopefully that did something. Nope. I hope that's what you wanted. Next time you need some comets mixed around. So I guess that there already have to be comets out for that to happen. So die. I want comets now, not later. Oh boy, what do Oh yeah, I forgot. Hold on. We have this. And I just so happen to think I remember where that is. So I'm gonna go in here. And we're going to save Luigi for the final time. At least I think. Um, honey hive. This is the place. This is the place. To be. To be or not to be. Be puns. Be Mario takes fight. To be or not to be. A Tony Hive Galaxy. Alright. So. I don't want you to bite me. I'm not a bite me. That's what he said, right? Bite me. No, I know what he said. BB, but still, it sounded like he was calling me a baby. Alright, let's stomp this piranha. Uh, maybe it wasn't that one. Let's stomp this piranha. Oh. I guess I have to get the bee suit, maybe. I guess that would make sense. I just have to figure out how to get to the other side. Break on through to the other side. Aha! I have these covered the formula. The crappy body formula. I have these covered the formula. Alright. So now we have to get up there. You can see Luigi just crying up there. Nintendo, seriously, how, why do you treat him so badly? <laughs> At least he gets games. Unlike a certain other character. Who was in a one Mario game? That cameo in in that one Superstar Saga game does not count. I'm talking about you, Square Enix. Give us back Gino. You know you want to. Gino for Smash Bros. Four. Actually, I'm just happy with Mega Man. <laughs> I'm just glad that we finally got Mega Man in Smash Bros. I can't really ask for much more. Except for Gino, of course. I'm never gonna start stop bitching about that. Oh yeah, and we just died. Cause I have literally no idea how to get back there. I really wish I remembered. That's why I was putting this mission off for so long. I just don't remember. 
Wait, this seems to be working. Oh, it was working so well, too. I'm gonna try it again. Alright, slowly going up. Come on. Oh. Alright, I'll give it one more try, and then I'll just give up on this method. Nope, not even close that time. Alright. Guess we just gotta figure this one out. And everybody who remembers how to do this is, do this is like screaming at me right now. It's one of the few stars I don't remember how to do, okay? Just cut me some slack. Alright, I think I have an idea here. Alright. <sighs> Stop talking to me. Nobody likes you. Stupid bees. Alright. Kill the innocent. Alright. Slowly run. Because you can't long jump as B Mario. Slowly run our way back here. And pray to God that we can get up here. Yes! Victory is mine. I don't even know if that was the way you're supposed to do that. Quite frankly, I don't care. I'm I just I'm happy to be up here and saved from the horrors of not knowing. Come on. Well gee thanks, that helped. Alright, let's come over here. He's up there, isn't he? Yep, he's right there. How are we gonna get up? Oh, okay. I do not know how I missed such an obvious detail. But whatever. Just gonna roll with it. Ow. Die on me. So what you're gonna wanna do here is walk carefully along this ledge. Not do anything reckless at all. Jump on this, so you can get a one-up, and some stibbits, and then, shake. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, hey, bro. I hid because of that big, scary bug. I found the power stars, so let's go home. Yay. And with that, grab that power star and let's head back. You, Luigi. So, in this episode... We took on Big Mouth Galaxy, saved Luigi again, and did a Speedster Comet over at Dusty Dune. In the next part, I'm gonna do something. Just not sure what. So this has been Bacon Burger King, and I'll see you all next time!